the, my projections of my art on one of her inflatable sculpt, kinetic sculptures moving around and becoming even more animated and distorted. And if you look at my work, you can see that I'm kind of into the distortion a little bit. It's kind of like you look at it and you're not sure what you're looking at. Then you look a little closer, and then you move this way, and it's something else. Quite a bit, actually. Yes. Yeah. Space. It's it just yeah. changing, changing all the time and evolving. And I like that. It's like a sculpture. Life is like a sculpture. together for um, I think over 10 years, definitely came to the modern dance scene. Um, she's recognized my abilities to vocalize and, and dance and move, so, so she sort of, um, uh, you know, hired me a lot of times for different projects that she's been involved in. Um, and so we just kept an ongoing relationship and collaboration in the last couple of years, um, working in more of a sort of creating together so there's no director or no one, so we're just working at, at a really sort of working at collaboration and, and producing works that incorporate vocal, body, theater, and that type of thing. So. Catherine Lee, better known as Celia, and I'm the artistic director of True North Performance. And tonight we presented Paya, and um, which we were really thrilled. People seem to respond very positively to. We're dealing with a, a, a number of issues, I guess, or ideas within the piece. We, we started out just experimenting with the dome and the chiclet that Evelyn Roth had created. Another 30 hours more or less working out some of the technical details. Of, and I, and I'm, by that I don't just mean the technical electronic details, but literally like, okay, now we have to unzip the, the zipper. In order for this section of the piece to work, we have to have the zipper half opened or we have to have it three quarters opened and we have to push it down a little bit so that Angela can get on it or whatever we're dealing with. Doing it, and tonight, as I say, we were totally thrilled with how responsive the audience was to the piece. They, and then we, we looked at the possibility of her actually drawing during, because we were very taken with some of her drawings which are just um, brief, brief uh, pushes of lines. 